What's up, my planning boos? Planning boo Prina back with another video. So we are planning for the week of the 17th through the 23rd. And this week I was inspired by one of my planning boos slash subbies, the Marvelous Beauty Channel. And she inspired me to pull out my dream seeker. So that is what I am going to do. So I haven't pulled out this book in a while, but as I flipped through it, I just remembered that, yeah, this book was so, so pretty. So pretty. So for starters, I'm just going to use this big flower, feather, leaf set. Yeah. So I'm just going to place it here. And that alone already looks very good on the page. Okay. I'm going to use my scissors, trim that down. If I can get this stuff off the scissors. And do my best not to cut the page. So that looks good. Okay, so now I'm going to take another one of these big flower sets, maybe. Making life decisions, as usual. Okay, maybe not there. Maybe not there neither. Mm -hmm. Yeah, we'll put this here. This book was so, so pretty. It's a wonder I haven't went back to it. You know, I think that's my issue, too. When I know stickers are so, so cute, I bought them to use them. But I don't, I don't want to use them because they're so cute. But that's what we bought our stickers for, right? We got to use our stickers. So gonna put a little quote here and yeah I can't believe that I wasn't scoot up or I didn't position the camera good enough to where y'all wouldn't be able to see what I had on but that's okay so we gotta have some copper in there so we're going to take this. You got this. Oh my goodness. That is so, so gorgeous. I love the copper. And I'm doing my best not to go get another sticker book. Because right now, Michael's got this sale where Happy Planner stuff is 50% off. Plus, they got a 20% off total purchase coupon. Which means you're going to get it for about 70% off. Oh, it's so hard. It is so hard. Because some books, I'm like, yeah, I can't get doubles of. Because that's when I'm more keen to actually using all the cute stickers. So I know I have an appointment on Monday. So put something there. And I also have something else to do on Monday. So I'm just going to put a note it right there. Let's see. So we're going to bring a little feather into the page with this quote sticker. Y'all, yes, it was in the morning when I was doing this and y'all can see my bonnet. I wasn't going anywhere yet. So, yes, I had my bonnet on my head. Don't judge me and don't act like some of y'all don't be playing it with y'all hair wrapped up or bonnets on. I really don't think I really checked the camera angle. I was so excited to sit down and do this plan with me. I didn't even check the camera angle. I was just trying to make sure I was in frame. So 
I guess. I'm going to put that there. And you know what I really like about this Dream Seeker sticker book? It doesn't take long for your spread to actually come together. That's the good thing about it. It just it doesn't take long at all. So I'm gonna put another one of those boxes here. Clearly with the way I had this camera angle, I'm gonna have to take a picture and put it on Instagram. So make sure y'all following me on Instagram. Um Y'all can either type in planning Buprina or y'all can type in planning and eating. My channel should, I mean, my page should come up. So, I'm just going to put this little move up, this little mantra sticker. Of course, you know, spreads are not complete without me lifting. There go that bonnet. And my glasses. Oh my goodness. Y'all are not supposed to see my extra natural beauty. Not just natural beauty, but my extra natural beauty. And my chest is all in the way. This is... Uh, I should have redid this video. But who was going to pull up all these stickers? I wasn't. While I'm sitting over here struggling with just one. Note to self. Check the camera angle. Next time I'm super excited. Okay. So that looks pretty good. I still need to figure out how I'm going to use those kind of diamond shaped stickers with the flowers. Still haven't really figured that out yet. So if you got any suggestions, let me know. At least where it would look good and go with the rest of the spread. Because I used one before and it just seemed like it kind of threw my spread off a little bit. And I just wasn't really that anxious to run back to it. So, but I'll try it again one of these days I'm gonna take one of these half circles oh my goodness I just I really should have checked this camera angle okay I'm not gonna say it no more I'm not gonna say it no more Definitely got to bring in some more of that copper. That copper is so pretty. If y'all know of another sticker book that has this much copper in it, please let me know. Because I love a good copper sticker. Okay. So, do, do, do. So, of course, this is the Dream Seeker spread. So, we need to pull out the word Dream Seeker. Put it right on the corner. Trim off that little extra because I wasn't finna pull that sticker up. I could have, but I didn't. And it is time to bring in some feathers. These feathers. This was another reason I grabbed this book because the feathers were so big, so big, so big, and so pretty that I said I definitely, definitely, definitely have to get this book. I'm gonna take another feather and one more. Just gonna spread them throughout. Okay, that's there. Want to kind of make them look like they're blowing in the wind, at least attempting to. Okay, a 
few more. Another one there. Let's see. What else can we use? Not. I think I'm gonna use these speckles. Make my numbers a little, a little shinier. Cause I was gonna put it right there at the top, and then I was like, no, let's let's dust up the numbers a little bit with this copper dust or copper foil copper foil or copper confetti whatever you would like to call it I just knew I wanted to make the dust look like it was coming off the numbers or falling from the sky yep just gonna put that there huh <sighs> it doesn't show up great on camera but it is very very good good looking in person but I think Instagram if I take a picture it'll help show it just a little bit better Another little one there. Uh, I am really, really loving this. This is turning out so cute. So I'm just going to pick up a couple more of the little smaller pieces just to spread them out. A little more. Just use some of that copper dust just to just to spice up the page just a little bit. I looking through, flipping through, still making life decisions. Just going to put a few of these leaves around. Because you know what this remi reminded me of as I'm looking at it? For some reason, it puts me in the mind of Pocahontas. You know, like that when all them leaves and dust and, and everything was blowing around her and John Smith. And she was singing, uh, can't you paint with all the colors of the wind? That's what this reminded me of. No, I cannot sing. So I'm not even going to do y'all like that. I'm nice. I'm nice. I'm I'm thinking about y'all and y'all ears, so y'all here for the plan with me, not for me singing. So that's what we gonna do. So one more thing. I have to pull out one more thing. And the I think y'all know what I'm looking for. I'm pretty sure y'all know. Yes, I did not have no shoes on either. No socks. No house shoes. So this is raw and uncut. So enjoy. Yes, I'm pulling out my LOL book because I need a doll sticker. I'm just going to pull out this girl here, if I can get her off the page. And just going to sit her right here next to the big feather. So look, this is so cute. I, it's so pretty. So excited. And I like it. So... I just want to say thank you to the Marvelous Beauty Channel for inspiring me to pull out my dream seeker. 
Um, I really, really, really enjoyed doing this plan with me, even though I had some camera mishaps. But look, it is so pretty against the purple disc. So make sure y'all like, comment, subscribe, share, and yeah, see y'all in the next one. I don't know what I was saying right here. But anyway, bye.